the column widget. This one is very common, but I will try to give you more information about it. First thing first, we have the children. This one will be a list of widgets, so we will just create a couple of text widgets inside, and this is what you will see on the screen. But you can also change the alignment of the column. If you use the cross axis alignment, and you say cross axis alignment dot end, this will align all the text widget to the end of the column. You can do the same thing for the main axis alignment. You use the main axis alignment dot end, and all the widget will be at the end from the main axis, which is vertical. There is a third argument called the main axis size, and you can set this one as main axis size dot minimum, and this will make sure that the column will take only the place that it need. So if I save, all the widget will go back on the top, even though we use the main axis alignment dot end. This is very useful when you don't want your column to take all the remaining place. 